Rock and roll. Nissan Zero Emission Leaf electric vehicle just got even greener. The latest version of the industry leader, introduced in Japan in November, has a new electric motor using 40% less of the rare earth mineral dysprosium without affecting performance. The driver will not notice any differences. Vehicle performance will remain unchanged. In fact, the overall performance increased, so drivers don't need to worry. Dysprosium is added to the Leaf's electric motor magnets to make them more resistant to heat as they spin at speeds of up to 10,000 revolutions per minute. A new process called grain boundary diffusion allows Nissan to drastically cut rare earth content in a way that may extend beyond EVs and hybrids to use in other automotive applications. This prosium is used not only in the motor to power EVs, but also in components of existing internal combustion engines. We are aiming to apply the technology to those components and work toward further reducing the overall quantity of dysprosium used. Using less rare earth content is a goal of the Nissan Green Program 2016, part of a commitment to minimize the use of scarce natural resources. Cutting dysprosium in the leaf also helps Nissan avoid supply constraints, with a large majority of the element mined in China and lower costs as demand grows. Rare earth metals, dysprosium in this case, are a scarce resource, which also impacts the environment during the mining process. Reducing the usage of such resources will reduce this impact. For a new generation of Nissan Leaf owners, greener production is already complementing zero emission motoring.